YouTube, YouTube, what that stuff do, man. Hey, look, go over there, like, subscribe, hit me with a thumbs up, let me know I'm kicking my stuff, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> and we're going to keep hitting with content, man. Right here, I want to say RIP to Coolio for the simple fact that, you know, it, in my era, he had that song called County Line, homie. I mean, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And uh, that County Line was a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Especially for those of us that came up in L.A., homie. And uh, that one on Imperial and Normandy, homie, was, was, was a motherfucker, homie. You know what I'm saying? A lot of banging went on at that motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? A lot of banging went on at that motherfucker. You know, in, 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 in our times, niggas that was hustling, we had count up all our cash and all our food stamps because it was paper food stamps back then. Niggas was still catching paper food stamps, you know what I'm saying? You know, so we would tally all that shit up. You know what I'm saying? And count all that shit as money with our cash and shit. Because some spots in the hood, they'll take them books of food stamps. You can buy liquor. Just say a, 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 you get a $30 bottle of liquor. You might pay 50 for in stamps for that motherfucker. You know, cigarettes, $5. You might pay 10 You know what I'm saying? We had people in our hoods that worked with us. <clears throat> With the food, paper, food stamps, homie. You know what I'm saying? They was a high commodity. But going into that song with the, with the homie Coolio, homie. Whole hoods back then used to go to the county and stand in the county line off that song, homie. That was like a real type G song, homie. And uh, I remember times going deep with my homeboys, dog. That motherfucker was like... 9,500 or a county jail type shit. And, uh, you'll catch different hoods in that motherfucker, homie. You know what I'm saying? Rips, blood, you know what I'm saying? Essays and shit, homie. And, uh, like I said, in my time, homie, before they put the metal detector detectors up like that, niggas would be going in with weapons, screwdrivers and weapons. You know what I'm saying? Niggas then took it to each other in the county lines and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about all our melee brawl throwing chairs and shit in that motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? So, <clears throat> the way they got it set up now, homie, I hate to say, homie, we was the era that made them really put safety upon themselves, homie, with, with, the, with, the, with, the, with the gang bullshit that went on in the county line. With the motherfuckers just going, being, having really mental problems, standing in that county line, homie. You know what I'm saying? So we was the kind of like the generation that formulated that motherfucker to being tight knitted, kind of like how it is now, homie. You know what I'm saying? So that's one rapper that I could say that authentically kind of kicked some G shit with that county line shit, homie, because. Anybody that know banging back in the days, homie, that county building was a motherfucker on Imperial and Normandy, homie. I done been with my homeboy, Lil G Half, was alive, homie. We was in that joint, homie, and got into it with some motherfucking, motherfucking rips. Uh, uh, you know, we banged out, because niggas used to go in that motherfucker banged out. You, 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 you know, some morning niggas will wake up, and whatever you had on, you will wash up. And hit that motherfucker. So we happened to hit that motherfucker. Washed up and hit that motherfucker flamed up still, homie. And we get in, have some words with some rip motherfuckers, homie. And uh, it go, in, it go into like a light scuffle, homie. Motherfucker tried to take off on me and shit. And I remember my young homeboy named up under me, Lil G. Hal. 
he ran to the car and grabbed the thing, homie. And you know what I'm saying? Was about to try to act a fool up there. But I was like, nah, fuck that. We up, you know what I'm saying? But uh, a lot of ax and young dudes ask y'all homeboys about that motherfucking Imperial in Normandy uh, County building, homie. Motherfucking straight, totally gang related, homie. So, uh, you know, thanks to our generation, we made it safe and we get a speedier process and a little shit like that. But RIP to the homie Coolio, man, that song ran through my mind. I said, man, let me kind of kick something similar to that just to pay homage to the song and just let people know that County Line was a motherfucking 89 on up, homie. You know what I'm saying? We're going to keep kicking G shit and not ye shit. And by the way, homie, I fuck with clothes and shit. So those that kind of want to get personal or just check a nigga style out, because motherfuckers be behind the camera kind of like sitting down most of the time. People who kind of want to still see the statue of a motherfucker. So those that it's on Instagram, you can go over there to and, and hit up Damn You Clothing and damn near get a profile kind of how my style and my character and how I mess with clothes and how my get down is, homie. So, you know, that's that. 89 on up, homie. I'm out.